Hey there fellow YouTubers, this is Chipsman aka Deathsquid here with another tutorial. This time it's a how-to on making your own custom wallpaper. Uh, I know I know there's many out there on Google that you may like, but I thought it was time to show the YouTube community something new. Um, the program I'm going to be using is a completely free. Uh, it's paint.net, the download link's in the description for those of you who want it. Um, now install it and open it. Here you'll see this and now you're gonna go to image and now you're gonna go to resize. And now first of all you have to figure out your screen resolution meaning your height and width of your computer screen in pixels. I know you can look on Microsoft's website and look around see if they have anything for you on how to figure it out or learn how to get it but I know how what mine is so I'm just going to put it down, 1200 by 800. Now, um, now we're going to make the resolution 1000. Now this is going to make a really nice sharp image. Don't worry about the print size, that's, where, that's if you actually put it on paper, which we're not going to do, so don't worry about it. It's going to resize. This is just 74% of the image, not the full thing, don't worry. It's not going to be blurry when you enlarge it or anything. Um, so. Now what we're going to do is, you have your image now, you can free draw or anything and make your own cool designs, but I'm going to open my internet browser, and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to Google up, I don't know, cool background, um, let's take this, copy image, edit and paste. And I just this image nice and big and now you control D to deselect now you have a nice image right here now what I'm gonna do now is add new layer and go to text we're gonna go to white and this is a custom font downloaded off the internet, so if um, you want to just Google it up. This is called You Murder BB. And let's make this nice and large. And let's just make this called. I don't know. Here we go. And um, now you have that. And this looks pretty okay, but we can make this better. What you're going to do is you're going to go to Layers, Layer Properties, and we're going to make this Negation. What this is going to do is make, it's, it's basically a, like a transparent metal thing, but with negative on. Basically, the light becomes dark, dark becomes light, and opposite of the colors are shown. As you can see, red is the opposite of blue, and this is dark red, so this is light blue. And you can still see the design through, which... Um, gives it a standout kind of look and as you can see this black part is continued but this is all white because it's on negative and this makes the image stand out a lot more because it gives it a more appealing effect so this is really simple you can play around with it add more layers and change like the even this image you can like change it and make a negative and add another layer just um uh, it's 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 really cool. You can just play around with it, and um, I, as you can see here, I've made one for Gag Gaming, which is going to be my YouTube series uh, on about um, glitches, achievements, and guides. So, but as you can see, I made the same kind of thing just to show you guys that look, it's complete. It it makes the image look much better as if this was just plain white and it was just boring and dull. This gives it a more transparent, more 3D look effect and it's, it's it gives an overall really nice effect. So I hope this helped guys. Uh, show me some of your wallpapers. Email them to me or message me with them and uh, I'll put them up on my channel. Alright? Later guys!